Alright, we're playing Super Mario Kart or the Super Nintendo version, it's the original, very original Super Mario Kart. Um, and as good as the new ones are, I don't think they're as good as the, the original. We'll do the slowest one, shall we? The options are a lot more limited, character-wise. Um, in Mario, shall we? So, three cups. Let's do the first one. Wait a minute. Remember the buttons. Yeah, that's it. So, I've just got to get back into it. Figure the buttons out and whatnot. It's pretty dated now, though, sadly. Oh, it's pretty dated, though. It's pretty sad that it is. So much more twitchy. I'm scared to even use this. I am all over the shop. I'm struggling with this. But I'm on ice. Yeah, I can't do turns. Um, might just try turning without the. Yeah. I've been using the jump as you would in the new ones. Don't do the jump. But the green shell stays um, still. I quite like the old map at the bottom. First level. First lap was pretty dire. Also remember I'm doing on the slowest um, race mode. I used to take a shortcut through there, it's all about remembering it all, isn't it? I think my love of the first one just stems from the fact that that was my childhood, I mean. Like all these old games are my favourite ones. Doesn't matter what they make now, I never feel they're as good as the originals. In time. Oh, he got me. Damn. That's a nice nudge, thank you. Gonna lap him. Oh no, damn, thought that was the last lap, okay. All I'm getting is coins, maybe because I'm at the front. Oh, 
this is a classic level, this one. Probably should have saved that for a shortcut. I can't remember half of it, I just remember how much I love this level. It's the challenge of it and taking a shortcut and... Oh, it's just brilliant, isn't it? I mean, look, it's so basic now, but back then, it was proper good. And to try and miss the jump there, just so you can get this, the um, special box. If I can get the feather, I'll be able to take the jump. I think, I don't think you can do it without the feather. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, you won't be able to do that without the feather. Right, I'll keep that, but someone will probably nick it off me with it if they get the ghost. That was close, wasn't it? Closer than I wanted, anyway. final race but no I think the next one's the final oh never a fan of this one it's the thing with Mario Kart you often have to do levels you don't want to do some you love some you hate it's part of the challenge I guess Let's throw that back there. Ah, oh, that's the part that gets annoying. Look, 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 how much that slows me down. I mean, I'm miles ahead if you look at the map, but you don't sort of think that way when you're racing. And the laps are so short that I think it's five laps of race then, whereas the new ones are three. Could have got crushed then. Just keep bashing walls. come first in all of them I don't think it matters where I finish the next race look at the scores right 27-9 so fourth comes gets one point yeah I think you only get what well, I didn't look I think it's 10 or 12 so I don't know not sure if he can equal points or as long as I come top four, I guess. Is 
say, I might have shipped that backwards. Oh man, that's probably my own shell. with an accelerator sometimes to get the corners rather than doing but on the new ones you'd literally hold the brake the jump button and it'll drift you around the corners this one you've got to let go of the accelerator a bit like scale electric there we go That was always cool when you were little and you get, and you get the gold, you feel like you've won something. But I'll do one play again and... No, wait a minute, where's the... Um... How do you go back? Oh, right. Oh, first, no! Alright, well, anyway, I think the problem I wanted. It's gonna be gone through, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, obviously, in the new one, you can do the battle. In the latest versions, you can do battle mode so with the balloons. Um, in this one, you. Oh, it's done it again. This one, I think you need two people to play it. Oh look! Right, give up. Because I want to see if two player will actually work, even if someone's not playing. Just leave their screen blank and see if other things. Because it might only be the um, might only be two if you're driving around. I think. Oh look, it can't do it because I can't get the other one to um, accept. Yeah, I think it's only going to literally be two of you. So the courses are... Oh, they're not changing. No, I don't want that one. So it's ice. So yeah, I used to love this one. It's basic. They're all very basic in the design. And like, like I say, there's no um, computer generated play, um, players in this, but oh, I absolutely love playing this when I was younger. And I suppose the memories, um, the memories and nostalgia are better than it actually is, I guess. 
Like, it doesn't really hold up well, does it? Compared to the new ones, but at its time, there was just nothing else like it. So it was just exciting. I absolutely loved it. And I'd always say this is the best Mario Kart, but now playing it, it's... Am I wrong? You know? Just getting mushrooms, that's that can help me in a balloon battle. Right, let's see if I line this up. Oh, he's over there. Right there. Oh, and it's on the other side as well. Alright, let's shoot it in then. Oh, just missed. Oh, I missed that. You ready? Blue, blue, blue. That's what you had to do as well. You had to look what colour zone they're in and figure out where they're hiding and whatnot. Oh, that's good stuff. Get yourself out of danger by jumping. Get hit by your own green shell every now and again. I think you got here by the green shell. But anyway, that's a quick look at um, the original Mario Kart. 